Erste, die war bei beiden Teams wirklich elementar und immer mit äh, einigen sehr schönen Plays verbunden. Mal gucken, wer es dieses Mal rausholt. So, sehr schöne erste Klicks. Ja, genau das. Da ist Zapsen. Es sind hier aber jetzt gerade Shots vom allerfeinsten. Faven und Dexter, die letzten beiden überleben dann aber auch die, können sowas nochmal rumdrehen, wird aber schwer. Ja, mal gucken, ob Santara noch einen verlandet. Nein, Dexter ist es. Ums Auto rum. Zwei gegen drei jetzt noch für Sprout. Machbar ist in der Pistolrunde alles. Dexter hat die USP, die One-Shot, Headshot, Pistol, Waffe und da ist der nächste blind. Kito aber am Start und da reicht sich ganz von Dexter. Heilige Maria Gottes, ey. Und da siehst du. Oh, 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 hey, willst du mich denn beenden, Mann? Taking him a few rounds to catch back up and. Well, that's a start and a half. Nice shot from Dexter. The nicest and any real aggression. Interestingly, you mentioned Tizzy, and he's going to pick up the AWP, and he's going to be exactly the same fate. T-side AWPing, normally a struggle, but Dexter making it look easy, and Tabson walks backwards. Two of your teammates have just died from that angle, and Dexter's so, just... The flash that he bounces off the wall didn't actually get Zontares. There's a pop flash here from Magix. He gets the assist. So while he's battling for long, making sure that that's I clear. I think just solid play from him so far. You pointed out that flash assist, which he got. This time Dexter dropping into underpass, and this could be a bit risky. He's got the first kill, but it might be time to get out of there. He's going aggressive, oh. almost the lineup, and he makes it a third kill. Dexter cleaning up against the Plenty pit. of cash coming up over the next couple of rounds, so it shouldn't matter too much for them throwing these weapons away, but there just doesn't seem to even be a way into this. They're going to use the molly to try and clear out the electric box, but that's given them absolutely nothing, and the afterplants look flawless. It's down to Dexter, but he does quickly land two kills. He's going to try and do something a little bit cheeky. Taps the bomb, beats out Spinny! That's the third, and now it's left all into the 1v1. I think the time might have just ticked away, but he kills... B was a ruse, but the HR side, they're aware of this fact, and these footsteps are going to be giving them away now, as on the default side... Sotvik does go down to Flarich. He does get refragged just barely, but man, oh man, Dexter, he's going to have to go huge here. He's still making footstep noises, and he has, doesn't have the bomb on his back, but the first kill does go his way, and now he knows where problem is, and he gets the spray down through the... Nade to one point of health, though, and the nade from Rixie will follow suit. Now Kai moves in, Finnegan with the AK hold on a reload, close range spray from the AUG, comes up good, four versus two, and now it's Dexter being quiet on the T side, going to get Rixie to drop, make his way back up to the site itself, looking at oh. that second player, lands the shot, now the strike in the past, we still couldn't convert the round, but I tell you what, getting a bomb plant at this point is a notable improvement over how the last six or seven rounds have gone. They have been shut out time and time again. Finnegan is having himself a great game, nearly a two for one. Crassy tag through Giuliano, and there we go! It's the collateral, and Dexter may not be done just yet. He's picked up a 4K. Maybe just a bit of a, a waterfall set up here. Force by coming through. P250 tries to tap up. Chiron does find a trade, but it's still in an advantage of the CT. Stop fix, shoulder baiting, trying to see if we can spot someone out here towards the T-Con entrance. He's sitting and popped up. Thanks to Wolsey Zorti. A turnaround from Stop actually does get caught off by Kensei. So, Kensei, I should say. So, 3v2. Damage being done to a Sparta, but as long as they can keep the AK in check for Patsy. Should have no worries, I don't feel like. Dexter with his three kills in this round. Eventually, they do get a deep oh, shot. Kensi! Oh, oh, my God, Dexter. From his teammate here. We'll have an opportunity to take a little bit of an ang. Able to find a kill onto BTN. The quick trade looking to come in as well here. So there is a player pushed up. We will see IM fall back. Cemente now up towards long here. There's the aggression from IM. The re-aggression falling back from short. Does get punished by Finnegan. We're into another five on three with Nexus unable to do much. The big difference that you're seeing in this game, uh, this map compared to uh, Mirage is Asparta have so much more team play um, behind them. Like something that Nexus has been well, pretty much lacking in right now. On the first map, it was a lot of individual star po power Former plays. Dennis ready behind the double doors. We got Truth and Decon. They are surrounding this bomb site cleanly. First fight is lost, but Marcellius in with a quick flick. Okay, it's not all bad. Dexter, meanwhile, one versus three, not looking good. Similar kind of position as we were in. He's managed to get the first, and 63 HP is certainly doable oh. for him. That spray down is genius. No one's on the bottom just yet. Looking for the third, and he gets it. Dexter, all three in and around, up and down. It's working. Dear 
is actually <laughs> at the very last possible moment when Navi needs it most. They do eke out a round win. Espada not going to be terribly demoralized by this anyway. So the, the battle is not over yet. Dexter is going to be trying to save this one with uh, a CT really close to him. Probably not going to happen, but okay, he does actually find the kill. So he can't actually go for this in a 1v2. There is still a minute left on the clock, Flakes. So maybe I signed this round away a bit too soon. <laughs> okay, Dexter or Deekster, as I should be calling you at Surely this not. point. How? How did he know to like, like he didn't pre-fire it, but... The presence of mind to, like, take your deagle out as well. He had the AK at the time, if I'm not mistaken. So <laughs> just an excellent shot into the, into the apartments area as he will be planting this bomb. And Navi, they thought they had this one, but it's all gone pear-shaped flakes. It's a 1v1. The bomb is planted in Dexter. He's hiding in pit, but as far as Capacho is concerned, he could be hiding anywhere. So he's going through apps just to make sure to have the high ground. And with 23 seconds left on the bomb, he needs to make his move soon. He does have a kit, so all Dexter has to do is survive long enough, distract him long enough to get him off the bomb, but he and just gets Dexter's the kill. AWP, he needs one backtrack and to stay alive for as long as possible. If he double dips and dies, then that gives away the whole of the curly letter. Instead, he'll survive, finding another frag for his troubles and Hellraiser's key mistakes. They're peaking this so low, cannot take down Dexter, down to 8 HP, but he can bail to B, and Hellraiser's still stuck in the mud every side of this map. The saving grace is the fact that Asparta seems to think that this is still a fake. They haven't rotated any of these A-men over. Finally, Dima starts to come in to help out, and Hellraiser is continuing to press on with this C4 in hand. They haven't checked for Kalinka, though. He's within the CT spawn and able to sweep away another. That was the heavy HP Dima, but Dexter's still doing everything. That's a quad kill. Go for the ace right now to finish. 15 Still, the lone player watching this be aggression. He's just re-peeking with the scout. The movement that you get while you're scoped in, really helping him out there, but... Man, this is still looking really tough for AGF, especially since, well, they're not going to be able to get to the low HPTs. Dexter is just defending them. Oh my god. Sadly, and that we is... won't get the chance to see it in this series. But if we ever got a third map, Josh, we've had so many this tournament. So many three mappers. I'd love to just see one more. Yeah, I would as well. I think it would actually be probably the, one of the most exciting third maps you could see. Wow. And Dexter, what a boost. He's the only man with the rifle in hand. And he's pretty much single-handedly converted the round that for his cash. team. Obviously, he doesn't want a spider in this force by to just pick up one of those rifles or perhaps all three of them. That is such a solo performance from Dexter. We often see him as the MVP, but basically without the AWP in many of these opportunities, he'll obviously get one in the next, committing this as a force buy, and maybe even a flawless round and ace for Dexter. That's we don't keep our eyes. Let's see. Why can't have a rock and a hard place here, having to try and worry about Dora as well as his outside push? Dexter will be coming. That there's a lot of presence here, and he's having to put up a bit of a fight. But thankfully, he'll also be coming. That he's doing it all himself. That's two kills, lock and key. A third follows, quick as anything. He's absolutely shutting them down. And actually, oh, Dexter's rotating as well. What's he going to do? Is he just going to play coffins, or is he going to fully get into CT? Looks like he will stay in coffins. I like this. Very tough angle to deal with. Good flashbang, and he lands the shot as well. And CT support now in play. Second kill in the bag from Dexter. He's done a great job so far, just holding on. And this is where the time pressure really starts to kick in. Rush inside is Freddy Frog able to find yet another one. Obviously, just the single M4A4 to hold up the line. And he hasn't got positional advantage to deny that bomb from going down. So with Relaxer on that bomb site, needs to find another before the digits tapped in. And he's going to fall. Ten seconds left for Freddy to get the job done. Huge.